Alrighty, I've been waiting for this all week. Welcome to Freaky Fridays, okay? If y'all don't know what Freaky Fridays are, pretty much I watch specifically extra, extra scary stuff, but mainly we're gonna be watching some scary short film horror videos, okay? Now, if you're, if, you know, for all the OGs on here, okay, for all the OGs, y'all know how much I love Alter's videos. Alter, I feel like, is like the peak of horror short films, along with like Llama Arts, and um, we watch other people, but I have short-term memory loss, so can't remember their names right now, right? And with that being said, whenever an Alter video pops up, I'm just so beyond excited. So, for today, we have a singular video. It's not three scary short films reaction. It's one scary short film reaction, right? It is an hour long special. Y'all better strap the fuck in, fuck boys. Because we have an hour long video by Alter called The Alter Files Ominous Offspring. So what I'm gonna tell y'all, like I said, strap in. Go grab you a little drink. I got me some gold peat sweet tea, the best sweet tea. Got me a box of goldfish, you feel me? And I got some chips and chewy cookies on standby in case I run out of snacks, right? I'm not gonna waste too much time with the intro. It's an hour long video. My videos already get to like 30, 40 minutes. Without further ado, Alter, Ominous Offspring. Go ahead and cook for me, my boy. Alrighty. Hope y'all are strapped in and ready to game. Got strap on me, no lesbo. I don't know what to expect from this at all. Their short films are already scary as hell. So I'm expecting this hour long one to be terrifying. Excuse me while I check the time I have left them on my camera before it goes off. Um, an hour and seven minutes. Luckily, it's an hour long. Okay, we're already starting off not fun. I'm sorry I have to pause so quick in the beginning. Uh, I'd rather do this now and get out the way. I uh, peeped last time, my last hour long video, uh, one of the comments, a few of the comments were like, we talk too much, me and uh, Twin. So I'll try to mim minimize how much I talk, even though it's a reaction channel, I'm kind of supposed to talk. But hey. No shade. Let's get it. Look through the fast bar. Is that say Jack? Is it is it J backwards? What the hell does duel mean? Alright, give him a warning at least first. Oh my god. Hello, Jack. I'm Dr. Gabriel Grant. You can call me Gabby. It's very nice to meet your acquaintance, Gabby. It's very Gentlemen. nice to make your acquaintance as well. I'm always very glad to make new friends. So where's your stethoscope? <laughs> I'm a different sort of doctor. I try and help kids with their bad feelings. This is really good production quality. <laughs> it's like watching an actual movie. Did your grandma tell you that you're going to be staying here with us for a little while? You don't look happy about that. 
I sure, I won't either. Better. You don't even have any Legos here. Oh, Pop your shit. Sorry about that. Maybe your grandma can bring you some of your toys from home. No, that's okay. I like your pictures. Your grandma no, you don't. brought me some from home as well. Always with the bear. And the clown. Do they have any names? That's Mr. Pinky and the bear's Captain Beasley. They're my friends. He put KB, he doesn't know how to spell. What's wrong with Mr. Pinky's hands? Nothing. Those are his fingers. Broken glass and razor blades and other sharp stuff like that. Scratching. And just who does Mr. Pinky scratch with these? Mm, sometimes people make me mad. <laughs> okay, dude. <laughs> okay. He blames this clown for doing this to his mom. And the neighbor's pit bull. No, the bear killed the dog. It was, it was Captain... Uh, Oh yeah, help me out here. Beasley. Beasley. Captain Beasley. Yeah. I know I know I said I wasn't gonna pause as much, but the reduction quality of this is like the absolute best we've ever seen on the channel. This shit is crazy. This is like an actual like Jesus, movie you see in movie theaters. Went right down the middle. So what are we thinking here? Is this dissociative identity or schizo? He looks really weird. Let's see what Gabby can get out of him first. So, Mr. Pinky scratches the people you don't like? And what does Captain Beasley do? W friend? His sword protects me, like a shield. W friend? Mr. So, Pinky has the sword. I was about to say a shield and sword. Did he draw the doctor? you he does but he doesn't like those men hiding behind the mirror they're not hiding jack they're just <laughs> they're hiding so i see you niggas <laughs> kid doesn't miss a beat does he jack <clears throat> we need to talk about what happened to your mom what you did to her with the scissors jack Jack. Jack. I didn't do anything! What the fuck was that? I'd like to go back Cursed. to my grandma's house now. You don't like me. That That's simply not true. I think you're a very smart, very special little boy. But I also think that you need help. Help to control your imaginary friends. Take us home now. I I'm sorry, Jack. Your grandma is not ready for you to go home. Personally, I know y'all might not want to hear it. Put the kid down. You have literally no you how the how in the hell are you about to sit there and be imaginary well imaginary in air quotes friends of his you're not gonna bite you're not gonna be a murderous grizzly bear one on one hell no that you can't even see and you're definitely not gonna be a sadistic lunatic clown with razor blades and shards of glass as his fingers you have no other option but killing the source the bear might maul you to death. But at least you saved other innocents. I, I'm sorry. I, you gotta euthanize the kid. I don't, I don't know what else to tell you. Jack, please. I need you to control your feelings right now. That's not gonna work. Jesus! That boy God, breath hot as shit. This is red hot. Why is it so hot in here all of a sudden? Do you believe in telekinesis? Oh, come on, Doctor. You don't think this kid is doing this with his mind? How the hell do you explain what's going on? I mean, I'm about ready to call an exorcist. Well, what do we do? Do we go in there? Yeah, no, that, that, that's a good idea. Why, 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 why don't you go? Please don't.
He just cut off her arm. Hey, at the end of the day, Captain Beasley's loyal. I, I, You can't stop him. Don't even call security. There's nothing you can do. Them fake ass guns and that budget cut ass taser. If this was the way I died, don't even don't even make a funeral for me. Don't even let don't even let my family see the body. Just incinerate me at that point. Don't don't let them know. Tell them I died by some big thighed, big booty black woman suffocating me with her thighs. I'm not about to die to a fucking teddy bear, bro. It's not about to happen. You're a trigger. Hell no. Oh. Damn, y'all got and carry the cap? Typical cop. There's still 50 minutes left. Hold on, we gotta. I'm not even gonna pause. I'm gonna keep going. It's called the Altar Files. So I'm assuming it's a plethora of different things going on. That was really good, though. I thought they were gonna expand on that more. I'm tired of seeing all these happy couples. Finna go ruin some. Okay, so who is this? I'm noticing a churn with bears. Okay, well, I'm glad they have subtitles. I don't speak this. That's not socially acceptable to say anymore. You can't say that, ma'am. That is older sister or his mom?
Ain't got nothing. Alright, what that got on? It's giving me older sister vibes. A dormir. O llamaré a tus padres. Babysitter? Now Timothy and that, that's what it is at the bottom right. It's a collection of different videos. A little bro about to get blit. First thing, I would just sit up fast and swing my arms rapidly to you. Does she just put that out on? That on the couch. Oh, hell no. Alter, what in the hell were y'all cooking up in the, the studio with this one? So is he, he friendly to, uh, I don't know what this kid's name is. I was about to call him Timothy. Obviously Timothy is the murderous rabbit that we have. Now that's stereotypical. Not all rabbits eat carrots, kid. Okay. You shouldn't have turned off the TV. I have to blur that because that was very graphic. And I don't think I can show that on YouTube. And the kid is next. Wow, that took a crazy turn from the last one. Timothy's voice sounded slightly like Dora for a second. That beat was hard as fuck. I try to pause as minimally as possible because of how long the video is. Timothy, no means no. Stop. Getting an FBI is now is the only correct way. Is that the FBI? Is that just the FBI? Is that like a special forces police unit? I don't know shit about law enforcement at all. Rainbow Six Siege, though, is what I play. Just peek that corner and just start unloading. Pre fire. You'll be good. 
I thought he raised the gun to his face. I was about to say, oh my god. <laughs> it's like that. I get it. But damn. Okay, so I still don't know. Is that a babysitter? Or the way he reacted, I feel like. Well, then again, you are a child. So I feel like watching anybody die in front of you would still be traumatic in general, but. Especially by your favorite TV show's host. Don't even touch me, Timothy. Never mind. I guess he didn't. Are they aiming at the kid or okay timothy that was gruesome i have to blur that um this is going to take forever to edit but i'm not going to pause as much so there won't be as much editing <laughs> a little bit lazy i know but uh yeah i know last time y'all said i talked too much but it's the credits so do y'all really even care if i'm talking over the credits so is each film just 10 minutes long I think we can skip the credits. Okay, you'll be mad at me if I skip the credits. Oh, it starts like right away pretty much. Well, Sally's birthday is actually on the 25th of December, but we don't think it's right that she gets more than her sister does on Christmas Day, do we? No. No, but it was her 10th and she always used to like soft toys, so we got her one of those custom made teddy bears from the Make a Mammal workshop. Paid for every extra. Made it smell like bananas when you smell it. Everything. Yes, and when you go in there, they um, they let Don't you. Don't smell like bananas anymore, though, does it? It smells like someone. No, well, no one's going to be able to smell it on the television, are they? So it's it's not a necessary detail. Waste of fucking money. Anyway, when you go in, they give you hearts <laughs> to stuff right inside the bear's chest yourself with your fingers. There's no blood, though, <laughs> is there? Not when they do it, no. No, and they give the hearts to all the kids that come in, and uh, they, what do they say to them? Oh, um, rub it on your heart so it loves you. Rub it on your knee so it needs you. Rub it on your eyes so it cries when you're not they there. They put a lot of thought into the wordplay. Yes, and you can buy these special hearts with a little button inside them. So when you give the bear a squeeze, the heart actually beats inside the bear's chest like a real one for what 15 seconds or so it's a cute idea <laughs> theory yeah but... so on um, christmas day we gave dostoevsky to sally we paid for it so we got to name it we wanted to try and encourage her to read proper books when she grows up we could have called it dostoevsky if we got her a dog one <laughs> i don't think they want other people to do the wordplay which is fair enough they're good at it she can't be trusted with dogs anyway Sorry. So, Sally gave the teddy bear a great big Christmas Day cuddle and she could feel its heart beating inside its chest. You should have seen her face light up. It was a picture. It was a She should have taken a picture back when she was okay in the head. And then she says, Mummy. Uh, what, um, why is his heart so beating? Well, Sally, if you want his heart to keep beating, you have to give him a great big cuddle. <laughs> And the thing is, we didn't really think she'd feel quite so responsible for uh, keeping the bear not dead. She didn't sleep that night. No, um, she just kept hugging him and hugging him and, and telling him everything was going to be fine. But the kid is delusion. Got it. Anything was wrong at first, but we just thought she really liked hugging it. In hindsight. She didn't want to go to prison for murder. No, um, so after... 78 hours huh? or so, um, she just calmed out. <laughs> God bless her soul. I'm not sure she has a soul anymore. No, by the time she woke sure up, there's a God well, either. she must have worn the battery out or the, the button got stuck um, because the heart just wasn't beating anymore. And um, well, we did 
didn't expect her to try quite so hard to bring Dostoevsky back to life. Didn't expect a lot of things. Every time she asked us to take her down to the butchers on a Saturday morning, we told her the same thing. Real organs won't bring it back to life. But we didn't want to discourage her from being interested in science. It was making her read proper books, mm. which is what we wanted in the first place. So we said she could use the basement. We wouldn't let her have it upstairs, not with how soggy it got. He got. Sally, I told you not in the kitchen. What the fuck? So, every day after school, she'd rush straight downstairs and with her doctor's books and put her little costume on and, and do her best to uh, resuscitate the teddy bear. We're not sure when she decided that conventional science wasn't enough or, to be honest actually, how she even knew about the occult in the first place. Yes, she did start drawing runes on the uh, basement walls with a hopscotch chalk at the Ouija board. The term started. I tend to sue me for saying back, the word Luigi. She really should have been a bit more suspicious when she offered to take Rufus out for walkies. She never did like that dog. Her sister was devastated when she saw the body. There was so much blood. Uh, it was all smeared round her mouth like, well, like blood. We don't know how much she drank of it in the end, but Rufus's carcass was dry as a desert by the time. We did think about punishing her, didn't we? But we thought the better parenting choice would be to make her undo the damage. Yes, she's down in the basement now because um, when the ritual succeeded, um, which did take us all by surprise, full credit to her, we made a deal with her. If she could bring Rufus back to life, like she did for um, Dostoevsky, then um, we'll get rid of Dostoevsky. What the fuck is that? What is Alter? What were you cooking? Here he is. You have to give him a bit of a, a squeeze above the sink just before you pick him up to minimize all the dripping. But uh, other than that, Sally doesn't play with him anymore. This is exactly why she doesn't get double at Christmas. He does wait outside the basement door for her, pouring at it again and again, a bit like a kitten drowning in a sack. It'd be cute if it wasn't actually happening. Well, as Sally's back to not sleeping, um, uh, for different reasons at this time. Um, uh, he does love her. <laughs> But, um, well, uh, the feeling's not exactly mutual. All well, that money we spent making it smell like fucking bananas. He does love her. He does need her. He uh, does cry when she's not there. Actually, it's, it's, it's more of a screech. <laughs> Put him down. Yes. I'm not even sure if it's possible. Rufus? Bill! Bill, it's Rufus! She's done it! Sally's done it! I told you she'd manage! <laughs> Excuse us. <laughs> that is so disgusting. This isn't even hard, I was just like, whoever, that was disgustingly wholesome. The beer wasn't as revolting as I thought, that's still so, I don't know how to feel. Ugh. I don't like where this is already going, dude. I burped. There's no need to be grossed out. 
you'll find them in a lot of different crops. And oh, is this about bugs? Oh. Unlike this little bugger. Uh, I don't like up close pictures of bugs. Oh, uh, no, I don't like this. Uh -huh. Is this about earwigs? Oh my god, bro, no. I don't do good with like up close pictures of bugs. So. Ah, uh, no, bro, why? Said he was playing around with his friends and got a twig stuck in his ear. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Believe it or not, I have seen this before. No, 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 no. Don't be worried about anything. It's just boys being boys. N no, nigga. Mm -hmm. Who is that? They weren't synced at all. I hear her talk about some laying eggs and shit. Like, ugh. Now that's crazy. How old are these kids? Kids like that deserve to get their ass whooped. There wasn't good parenting. Ugh. Whoever was in the studio writing this had to be on some type of like narcotics ultra. He's about to lead that kid to his death. Psycho. What? Do you think your mommy was gonna be down here? Hey! He is the freak. Jump his ass. JJK that shit. Yes, sir. Maybe I need to clear out your ears so you can hear me. Watch out for Willie. I, I just didn't expect that out of all things to happen. That kind of got me. Uh, do y'all mind if we just skip like the credits? You know, you feel me? Like, your driving is. Oh shit! I skipped you for. <laughs> your driving isn't bad. It's just, <laughs> it's just a little, you know, sedate. It's it's safe. Yes. Safe driving. Yes. It's belts and braces driving. <laughs> yeah. Spirit of the war driving. Yes. yes. Exactly. In making way for vertebrates. I love turtles. They're, they're Same. Vertebrates, <laughs> idiots. <laughs> what am I thinking of then? Uh, snails. <laughs> oh. Very similar oh. to turtles, only completely different. Oh, good God, you're boring. I know. Right? <laughs> Sorry. So anyway, I've, I've got Emily uh, a little present, oh, just no. a small cuddly toy thing. But do you think it's the sort of thing she might like? These whiskers are bent. Um, 
Look, it's it's really cute, and you've been so kind and thoughtful to think of buying her a present. Is there a book coming? I just don't want you to be disappointed. It's it's just that she she's into penguins now. She's all happy feet, and that was it. But he's a very friendly lion. Jeez, my dear, driving. <laughs> Get that thing off me. Anyway, it's not big enough. She's sort of into bigger toys now, and that's definitely not big enough. <laughs> Are we still talking about the lion? We, we, we shared the same sentiment. Here we are. Home sweet home. You're the penguin. Are you alright? Yeah, why? I don't know. You seem a bit nervous. No, I'm fine. It's just, it's just that this is kind of a big deal, isn't it? I mean, there's a lot riding on this. Yeah. I really like you. A lot. I'm really <laughs> looking forward to meeting Emily, and it's important to me. Does she give my boy some, please? To us, that she likes me. This really feels like the start of something special. It do. Something that the three of us can build together. Relax, you big cheese ball. I need me up. Fine, shit. Do that to me. Mom, Mom, you need to come quick. Hello. It's Peter. He's been hurt. That is a terrible first impression. Well, not first impression. That is a terrible first thing to walk into. Oh, dear. Who slit its throat? Oh, no. How mad you gotta be at a goddamn stuffed animal? You can't let him die, Mom. I need him. Yeah, you don't need him. He's part of the family. Well, Emily, it's a good job I'm here. Because I've brought a furry little friend with me. And I think you guys... It's can... not big enough, Nigel! Can you stop breathing, Mum? We need an ambulance. I've already called them. An ambulance? Rachel, is this a joke? Where's the incident? Sorry about this, fellas. It's a false alarm, I'm afraid. Get the kit. We need to act fast. I need you to keep calm, sir. I need you to be brave for your loved ones. I don't understand. What's going on? I need you to breathe, OK? You're starting to panic. I'm not panicking. I'm bloody confused. What's going on? Shit <sighs> like that, I was just like, all right, whatever, bro. You feel me? Like, do what you have to do to save him. That's it. Just keep breathing. We need to do a transfusion now. We'll never make it to the hospital in time. We need somebody to give what? blood, otherwise he's not going to make it. Oh, no, oh God, no! <laughs> not our Peter! <laughs> Rachel, what is going on? <laughs> Sir, you're getting hysterical. No, I'm not. Listen to yourself, you're shouting! Yeah. This is ridiculous. Rachel, please! <laughs> Rachel! I'm on his side on this one. Are you crying? This is a life or death situation. Rachel. <laughs> Will you stop crying for fuck's sake? Sir! Mind your language, you're frightening the child. Rachel. I didn't mean to. Emily. It's not big enough. 
wonderful phrase. This is actually a terrible one. I think I should go. What? We need you here! We need your help! Yes, Nigel. We need you to be a man. We need you to step up. I need to take you. I need to go. I'm sorry, Dad. I'm so sorry. I don't blame him. What the hell? Is that like all the ploy to get him to leave? We're just not gonna talk about that. There were some complications with Peter. The nice ambulance men did the best with what they had. They know how much you loved him. I want my friend back. I know, sweetheart. That's a clown. Which is why they've done something even better. You can come in now. Peter! I thought I'd lost you. I love you, What Mom. was I just looking at? I love you too, sweetheart. Did they get the guy and put the penguin head on him? And look! He's even bigger than before. Your friend sure is a fast runner. Not anymore. <laughs> That just is no comment on that one. I don't know which one me to say about that. I'm not even going to try to pronounce that. He will eat you? For any of my Hispanic subscribers, is that a real lullaby? Yeah, they own some freak shit with these ones. Altered cooked completely.
I'm not even crying anymore. He will reincarnate among us? What do you have your children listening to go to sleep? That does not sound human. That sounds like a goat trying not to shit itself. It's like a goat trying to piss out a kidney stone. Oh my goodness. Hey, how you doing? Seeing how these have went so far, this is about to be some disgusting ass shit to witness. Said, she gave birth to a demon baby. Oh my god, what does that even mean? I don't I can't read the title. I don't speak Espanol. It's a cat. It's gonna be a demon cat. Uh, oh. It was just a normal cat. Just a vanilla cat. Bless you. She better than me. First thing I'm doing, the second I open that door, mm. I'm not even asking the worst. I've been getting big. I'm ready to throw hands. My arms are so sore right now, I can't even flex quickly, yeah. bro. Yeah. Chicken tenders, onion rings, and I got a few cookies. Say it. Um, Gator. Yeah. Yeah. I'll call you before I go to sleep. This is where well you should have been scooped with the babies, skedaddled out the house. I see that? Look big, yeah. That boy getting big. You go in there, scoop up the babies and walk out the house. They're not even crying. There's two heads, two baby heads. Next time she comes in there, y'all seen the box? It had the baby head, well, it was the devil, but then it transformed to two baby heads. She's gonna look down, it's gonna be a double head right in her face. So I'm gonna do it with two babies, They're the same thing as the box. Y'all get what I'm saying, they're gonna be a devil.
told you. That is so disgusting. Very disturbing, actually. Told you. Alright, I'm gonna need Teach to stop greeting because it's blowing up my phone now. Uh, where would the children sleep at night? I got the gun aiming with the sights. Mm, that thought I was gonna keep rapping. I can spit if I really wanted to. It's not trying for it. I can spit if I really wanted to, yeah. That's how, like, dads be snoring. Wait, we're, almost, we're already almost... This felt like it went by very quick. Holy crap. How much time do I have left on my camera before it goes off? 18 minutes. Oh my god. What is this melody? Let's get down with it. Driver, what is it? Dead Nigga, was that Dave Chappelle? Oh, now I feel racist. That was not Dave Chappelle. <laughs> <No. laughs> There's so much copyrighted music in this. That's a very nice shot we just had of the bear. Hey. I'll play Dying Light. Oh my god, Jesse, thank you so much. Yeah, of course. That the mom? Oh, she was great. She, I want to see her dad. I could be the stepdad. Eight o'clock. Eight o'clock, okay? Great. Okay, thanks again. Thank you. She like her stomach hurting. All them damn Nothing cookies she ate. Cakes. Nothing. How many cookies did you eat? I only had one. One? That's... A lot of crumbs for one cookie. I only had one. She lined her no, ass off. I actually off. counted every cookie in that cookie jar. And if you did only have one, like I said, there should be exactly 13 cookies in that jar. You didn't count them. This is really ominous music for counting some cookies. What the hell? How are you gonna flip this? This is our new cookie jar. I do not like it. Well then don't put your hand in it. This cookie jar is for adults only. Any time that a child has stolen a cookie from this jar... Why would you bring that home? Bree, no more cookies. Uh, okay, that's kind of extreme. Trying to murder a child over some cookies is kind of crazy. Might need to call CPS. Might need to call Dyfus. Just saying. That's... Uh, what happened to my audio? Excuse me. Uh, excuse me, I'm recording a video here, god damn it, what happened? What? Give me a second, guys. For some godforsaken reason, my computer decided to mute itself. I didn't know you could even do that. How much time do I have left? 14. If you're asking me why I'm doing that, it's because I have a white background, so I can't see the time. It's like right there. 14, 18 left. That kid really risking her life for some cookies. That is so crazy. Cookie?
and she's cooked. You're done. It's gonna be a goddamn razor blade in there. It was just a hoax. Yeah, cookie jar. I I, I knew that's what happened. Just as old Pierre said. I seen that too. Make sure I'm not tripping. Mom. Mommy can't save you now. You should have listened and not stole a cookie. I'm trying to see a clown to the side, but I ain't see no clown. There's some behind that door. I'm not even gonna rewind. I told you I was gonna be pausing. Alright, that's not mommy. Kids are so ignorant. Why would you even approach that? Like, that's not mommy. Oh, so the thing just gives you nightmares. That was a really random angle to have. Why are we looking at the babies? What the hell? Are you gonna be okay? Hell nah. Close the closet door. Close all the doors. All right, well, you know where my room is if you need me. Leaving her alone to die against the clown is a crazy mothering strategy. That's not going to do nothing for you. This is not Five Nights at Freddy's. Your ass is cooked. Should have never stole from the cookie jar, like Mommy said. Mommy is fun shit. My bad, Jock. My camera will cut off by itself if I let it go down to the very last second. Ten minutes left. How much time is left on this? Five. Okay. This clown is not only a weirdo, he is a pervert pedophile. Cause why is he stalking this little girl? We need to call the new age pred hunters. The ones that be beating the shot of the predators. Well deserved. I think he was behind that door originally when she first walked up the um the thing.
Ooh, that was in the booth making this one crazy. <laughs> Whoever made this went stupid. Mm. Oh, I hope that's not copyrighted. That music was so tough. I don't have to cut that out. <sighs> Is that just not going to piss them off even more? Bless up, we got a happy ending. That baby's head moved, by the way. Okay, let's be honest. We know it's not gonna be a happy ending. Alter never has happy endings. <laughs> You don't know? No. Bree, did you take the cookie jar? No. Nobody likes a liar, Bree. Well, no more cookies in the house then? No more cookies. Thursday, right? Uh, yeah, I'm not sure. I'm not sure it's gonna work. Okay, well, uh, I have your money here. here. Just, it's fine. Just, yeah, send it to me. No, no, thanks. Okay, I gotta go. Bye. Word. Hi, honey. Hi, mom. Wow. Another masterpiece. Come on. It's way past your bedtime. Wait. Monkey. Hey, don't call me that. Is everything good? No. Yeah. Yep. Hell no, nah, you haven't seen the okay. creepy ass dolls. I was fully expecting him to be in the corner of the room. Good night. Yeah, How much time do I have left for the outro? Five minutes for the outro. Listen, let's speed run this outro. First of all, uh, that was every single one, honestly, I thought was pretty good. Um, I think my least favorite one was probably the one with the um the bear and the weird not the first one, but the weird like amalgamation of a, a dog's heart inside a bear stuffed bear. Whatever that one was, I there is no need in this world for that to be created. It was disgustingly kind of wholesome because the bear just seemed cool, but it just looked disgusting. But um, yeah, no, I mean, I I definitely enjoyed um, I definitely enjoyed this entire hour long like files. I guess they have. I don't know if they have any more of these. If they do, then we'll definitely do some in the future. But um, no, I definitely thoroughly enjoyed this like movie thing i thought it was gonna be like an actual movie movie but it was just like a combination of a whole bunch of shorts putting together into one um i did peep so i would assume that these are these are actual i'm sorry i explained earlier why i did this but um i did peep from that kooky one that 
these every it seems like every single one inside of the ultra file seems to be an actual separate video by itself i remember seeing the kooky um the thumbnail for that individual video by itself i think the video by itself is like only like 10 minutes long something like that so uh i thought they had made a whole bunch of original ones and and this is what it is not obviously not saying it's bad that they didn't create any original ones that's that's what i thought it was going to be uh i never seen any of these obviously i only had ever seen the cookie um thumbnail but i never actually tried to watch it before i don't watch these without recording i, I don't really care to watch them by without i don't care to watch these outside of me recording i watch gaming videos outside of that but um you know i thought it was a really good um video overall i thoroughly enjoyed it for sure um Hey, let me know if y'all want me to do another one of these hour-long compilations. I try not to pause as much to yeah, give us good. give it like time just to go. And I will admit, a little bit of a lazy YouTuber this time around. I don't feel like editing an hour-long video because that would take me forever to do. But um, yeah, nah, overall, I thoroughly enjoyed it. And watching this, and I will see y'all later. Peace.